Alright, so I'm gonna throw my brand new discs for the first time right now. We're gonna start with the slow speeds, go up to the high speeds, um, start with the putters. The lunars I'm not gonna throw because they're for putting. Soft enemy, let's see what it can do. So throwing putter, backhand. Let's go. Not bad, I mean, it went pretty straight. The hold the line kept going, and because it's brand new, and Envy stable out, it's great. Uh, I'd imagine that once that beats in a little bit more, that it's gonna be straighter. So great. Uplink and deflector, pretty opposite discs. We're gonna go with the uplink first. <laughs> pretty far and but that's not how I'm normally going to be throwing it you know it'll be more of a turnover shot anyways uh, deflector over stable mid-range bit of an annu wow not the best throw but great did next time we've got the speed seven discs we're gonna start with the crave six and a half I'm expecting it to go nice and straight with a little bit of fade at the end. Wow, I'm quite surprised by that because it does just go straight. So again, great for the woods, great for something that's just easy to throw. And again, I imagine once that beats in, it's going to have a little bit more flip to it. The rhythm is basically the slightly more understable version of that. So. I'm hoping that I can put a little bit of highs on this, have it flip up and push it a little bit to the right before coming back. So let's see. It's a little bit higher, but I don't dislike that. I think it didn't really turn at all. So maybe it's because I threw it a bit high and a bit too much hyzer. Had it been a bit more flat, it would have turned. So I'm interested to see how that is when I throw it again. Uh, let's go with the evader. So I'm expecting that just to be nice and straight, fade, just like an explorer would. Yeah, exactly that. Nice and predictable. My only concern now is that all these four discs that I just thrown all do the same thing. Uh, so it's about finding out how are they different from each other and when do I use which disc in which scenario. So rather than having four the same that do the same thing. Um, this is the vault. I went for the blank one so I can get some stamp on it. pretty much the same as the Evader. So I think personal preference between those two. So I'm probably the most excited about the Inertia out of all the discs because it's something that's got a bit of turn to it, which I don't normally do. Most of my discs that I throw are overstable, so they're just straight fade, straight fade, and force the Anheuser. Hopefully this will have some turn, which means more distance. So that definitely had some turn. I like that disc, I need to throw it a few more times to learn it exactly, but that went straight, turn, 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 and didn't come back. So maybe it needs a bit more highs on it, um, or throw it a little bit higher, but great disc so far. This is the Defy. I decided to go for a blank one instead, last minute change, but uh, again, should be quite overstable, but I'm hoping to have a little bit of turn just to get a bit more distance. Yeah, I like that. I like that disc a lot. So we've got the Fission Wave. This is quite unstable, so I'm probably going to try and throw it a little bit higher up than I normally would and give it a bit of hyzer just to not turn over too much to become a roller. Oh, 
a bit too high. Yeah, definitely a bit too high there. Enigma, is this your first throwing this, Tom? Nope. Nope. Let's find out. I like that it's a bit soft, like that. Wow. That's probably the first throw so far. Uh, I was quite surprised by how much turn it has, and then it just keeps pushing and not fade over too much. So, love that. Great. Right, last two, <laughs> ESB force, overstable distance driver, and then the face. Wow. I was actually expecting that to have a bit more fade, being a bit more overstable, um, but I really like the flight of it. Um, nice and straight and definitely had a dependable fade at the end. Phase. I don't know if this is just a silly disc, but let's see if it can fly. Oh yeah, very good. So that was just straight out, wanted to turn early, kept going, just nice and predictable, into headwind, that's the best disc. Let's go and do a couple putts with the new Lunas, then we're good to go. What distance should we go from? Five meters. <laughs> Five meters. <laughs> Can't miss the first one. Ah. They feel good. It's starting to get a little bit cold out here, but um, try a little bit further away. Yeah, so far, so good. And a little bit further away. Yeah, I'm sure they're going to be just fine. So like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. And check out all the other bag videos I've done where I'm building a brand new bag for 2023. And see you in the next video. Bye.